In this video, Terrell DeCosta and I will be reviewing Granola AI. Terrell is a product manager and an enthusiast for all things related to AI. He is in fact building AI products entirely through Vibe Coding. Granola is an AI-powered tool that transcribes your meeting, allows you to take notes, automatically enhances them, writes follow-up emails, and does much more. We simulated a user research meeting and we later reviewed the notes and tested Granola's features. Title this as Customer Research for Cafe. So I want to build a cafe. So I want to understand like what type of cafes are popular in Amsterdam. My target location right now is Amsterdam. So I want to understand like where do people usually hang out? Like is there a specific type of cafes? Is it a theme cafe? Uh, can you maybe share some highlights on that? That is like what's common among people these days? Yeah, I think I can tell you from my experience. First, let's try the enhanced notes. Okay, so it is doing coffee culture in Amsterdam, cafe types. That's nice. Yeah, I think here it kind of hallucinated about, I mentioned like frequented by older folks, but it filled in the whole mornings and afternoons bit. Or mm -hmm. did you mention something like this? I don't think I said older folks frequent cafes. That definitely is off. I mentioned that people generally go in the morning. These are things that I actually typed out that it has now corrected and not exactly what I wrote, but like something along these lines. They improved it a little bit in English. Yes. And I think it's doing this white and gray difference. I think the white maybe is the ones that I actually wrote down and it uh -huh. has like corrected and gray is like filling up the gaps. Let's see if we can ask some questions. Do you want to try these for the standard? Uh, yeah, list action items. Let's try that. I think that's pretty good. Write a follow-up email. Let's also try that. Let's see what it does. I love this one actually. Yeah. Because uh, generally I struggle with writing follow-up emails after a meeting. And let's ask something from the enhanced notes. If this is a customer interview, you want to know some two to three key insights. Give me uh, three key insights on cafe culture or coffee culture. Many cafes close after 4 to 5 p.m. Interesting pick though. Interesting pick. Yeah, because a lot of it, I think, like my focus was on typing out the notes. So I think I might have missed out a lot. So if it is actually picking up what you've said and, you know, summarizing it, I think that's pretty good. This is the problem I have with customer research interviews where you tend to take notes for one point. Customer has moved on to the that's next two, three one. points. Yeah. And now you struggle to understand what was the customer saying. So that's what, like these kind of insights get missed out. Second one is portion size is a small and excessive coffee drinking is uncommon compared to places like the US. This is customer interview so factually may not be correct like we don't know right. the statistics there but that's what customer felt. So typically if I'm doing client interviews for let's say existing products what I'm looking for is if they mention some things like there is a bug um, or new feature request that I miss out. So right. I could use these kind of tools and ask how many times the customer mentioned bugs and where was it or what was it. Um, hmm. So that then it just, I don't have to listen to entire interview in that case. That's the idea in my head on how I would use it. Respondent mentioned the roast of the coffee four times. And say it gives the examples where I mentioned it. Yeah. I think this is pretty good. You can share the notes, right? So can you copy link and see if I, I can access this? For one-on-ones or somewhere where the meeting was supposed to be, let's say, brainstorming. And you and engineers were discussing something. And right. the, the same notes can be shared with both the engineers and product managers. And then you can yeah. come and ask now, uh, what did the engineer mention about the approach? And then engineer can ask, what did product manager say about the business metric? But you can ask it to create like a flow chart of the conversation or like some sort of like visual representation. So let's see if it can visualize the cafe types. I don't know if it can. Let's see. It gives me a way to do it. But I could use this, put it in maybe chat GPT hmm. or image gen generator and then I can get that. Okay. I think it needs more workflows in the sense of, you know, like it should create this document in my Google Docs so that I have these transcripts or like it distill them into like shorter notes or something. Because might if it do that in this one, if you click on that back arrow button and go to your dashboard of Granola. Yeah. What is there in your settings? I'm thinking integrations, right? So they have Notion. Connect and duplicate the template into private pages. So it will create a Notion doc for you. But I'm guessing this is where they will have more features coming. This is a good feature though, auto-detecting meetings. Internal jargon. See, this is good. A lot of process-related words like in fintech, we have lots of terminologies which are very like abbreviations, you know, things right. like that. 
right now if you saw the transcription also like over here here if you see it's like a two way conversation i was wondering how it is like if you have a third person also added all right we found granola to be incredibly powerful customer research sales calls brainstorming meetings are just few examples of how you can use granola teral and i also tested in hindi language hamare product par charcha karne ke liye aapka dhanyawad and i'll be uploading part 2 very soon so if you're curious about that you might want to subscribe that's all for this video thanks for watching